Why poly people are going to come to therapy um, and where you can help and where maybe what is happening in the room is not so helpful. So number one, a lot of people are going to come in going, is this right for me? I've I'm I'm been cheating. You know, I don't often offer polyamory to people who walk into my office. If people come in, they're like, I want to talk about polyamory. I'm like, right on, let's do it. But if someone's been cheating and is feeling torn up about it, I'm like, you know, there's this thing called polyamory. What do you, you know, Google it. And that's my therapeutic intervention, Google it. Um, <laughs> you know, and then I'll follow up next week. So it's not something I push on people. Um, but I definitely, again, it's that introduction, that aha moment. And did you know there's a way to get sex with other people and be honest with your partner about it? About it? And when I say it like that, most people are like, oh, no way, no way, it is too hard to talk about. They will for sure reject me. I'm like, so they're not going to reject you once they find out you're cheating? Huh. Right? And so this is the dilemma we have.